be freaking happy about that. If you need some HG transistors, text, don't call, text 678-557-4846. That's 678-557-4846. If you never dealt with me before, ask for a price list. I got one already pre-written. I can just type GK. Uh, what do, what do I, have? I got an HGGK and it'll pop up my quick send on my text messages. Hotkeys, I think that's what it's called. So just shoot me a text and like I said, I got medals and I'm working on something pretty neat over here that I haven't showed y'all yet. And I, like I said, I don't know how good this is going to turn out camera wise. But I have been working on a little program, and here it is. It's going to be called Kit Builder by Gatekeeper. And basically what this is going to allow me to do is this is going to allow me to design kits for people. Because I still kind of want to, I don't, I don't know if I'm going to go in this full-fledged where I'm selling kits to everybody. I, it ain't really that. This can be used for a lot of things. I mean, this can be used by other builders. I've already talked to a builder or two that says, wow, I'd love to use it. Because you can use this for a lot of things. And I will show that more with an actual screen grab so you can see everything very well. But basically, I'll load my parts up right here. You know, I can have multiple banks of parts. Let's just say every part I have here at the shop, every part. I could That could be one list. <laughs> Or I could have a bank of parts, let's just say for base amps, a bank of parts from parts from mobile amps, for LD MOS amps, for for this, for that. Doesn't really matter. I mean, you can this can be used for a lot of things. And I've already worked in, uh, started working on the functionality a little bit already. Like you click start new kit right here. You enter the name of kit. Let's say I'm be working on a kit for a four pill HG. 2879C mobile box. Press OK. And boom. Current kit name. 4 pill HG 2879T mobile. And then I'll start and take the list of parts right here and start dragging them over. Dragging them over. Dragging them over. And the price will be increasing with each item that I dry, uh, drag over. I'll be able to print this. I'll be able to save it. I'll be able to email it. Whatever. You know, and I'll and I'll build a slowly build a, a full kit uh, data bank here, pretty much. You know, so it just makes it a lot easier on me instead of having to go through there, you know, doing it manually. And I actually worked on this today, load existing kit. So we'll go load this. I just got out here for just a test, two pill amp. Click OK. So I just added just one, two, three, four, five, six items, and I've got them in a string a particular re way so the price can be added up. And you see that the updates with a uh, five total items, 159.55. So to add all that, all that up, and over here a bank of parts to give you the total items, and if you want to add something to the, your database to your bank of part database. You know, it'd be something like, you know, just for example, you know, half half inch stainless steel handhead screw, just for example, you know. You'd pay a space, you would do an at sign, dollar sign, zero dot, eight cents, as an example, and press enter, and it'll add it to the list. And then let's say you you need this part, you get it, drag it over here, or we, I'm I think I'm gonna have I'm gonna have it to where you have a couple of different ways you can do it. You can drag it, you can click on it, press space bar, or uh, I think there was one other way I can't remember right off my hand because I need a, a way too to where if you click it, so you can edit it. I think I'm going to do a double click for edit, so you, if you ever need to change the price, or change the name, change whatever, you can edit it, and every time you edit, it saves the file, every time you edit this, it saves the file, there's no saving, there's no need for saving, 
the saving happens when you start a new kit. And uh, the saving happens when you start building a data bank, data, a bank of parts. It, it'll load up as the default, or it'll load up with the last bank of parts that you did. So I'm going to do it where it's easy as use, to use as possible. So basically, you'd press enter or whatever and add that to there. And then when you need to use it and drag it over here, a window will pop up and say, what is your quantity? How many of these do you want to add? So there you go. And I hope to God you're been able to see this. I ain't sitting here just been talking about it and you ain't been able to see it this whole time. <laughs> so there you go, y'all. I can't wait to see how this video turns out and see how terrible my audio sounds because I'm worried about the audio. We'll see, y'all. I got some cleaning up to do over here because I'm going to be working my butt off the next three months. Three months, y'all. You're going to see a big change from Mr. GK. Get these transitions while you can, y'all. I mean, get, get these transitions while you can at the prices they are, if you haven't got from me yet. And we got these medals for you. 73 GK out here around the northeast end of Georgia. May heaven smile upon you, fellows. I'm gone. Bye-bye.